Hello everyone and welcome back to Chorus. As you see, I'm still in the same screen I was before, but I did have a quick look at stuff because I was debating whether to compare the Gatling gun and the laser to see which actually did more damage. Um, and looking at it, it seems like the laser actually does more damage when it's upgraded. I've got a fair bit of credits now from doing the side missions, so I can actually upgrade a few stuff here. So, first of all, we're going to get the better laser, because looking at it, it's plus 54 damage there, which puts you on 204. Um, this one puts you on 215, which is obviously higher, but I've also got the Gatlin damage boost for 9% there. And if you work it out properly, um, we've got the combat protocol one here, which is plus 13.5 as well. So if I get that plus the laser, it actually works out slightly higher damage than what the Gatlin gets. So we'll go for that instead. I may regret this decision because I'm not really that much of a fan of the laser, but we'll see. I'm still going to keep the max ship speed rather than um, changing them both to extra damage because I feel like the ship speed is actually really important, especially if you get stuff like that race mission that I previously had. Um, yeah, that's the one I wanted. I mean, realistically, plus 9 damage, I'm not sure how much difference that makes. It might actually be better getting um, the the shield thing instead. Like, the max shield's plus 25. That might actually be better. I'm not 100% sure yet. The one thing I did say, uh, notice, though, is I also now just got my fixer. So, this I got for free, and it seems like it's an auto-repair thing. Um... However, that makes sense now to go with this automation protocol, which reduces the cooldown for it by 10%. So obviously I'll lose a lot of damage if I did that, but it increases the cooldown for it to repair myself. So, it, you know, it remains to be seen whether that's actually worth doing or not at the minute, but for now I'm not going to bother. I'm also going to upgrade the um, Gatlin to the second one because I've got enough for it, so... I was only going to do this if I had enough left over, but it seems I do, so might as well. Could have maybe done a shield fragment there instead, or a couple of them, but to be honest the shields disappear in two seconds flat, so I'm kind of putting that as a low priority at the minute. The weapons were much more important. And we'll carry on with the story. I must go. And I might never see you again. Yes. I'll try to contact Ree. Ree? in the resistance. Maybe they can come. Goodbye, sir. Yeah, there you go. So I can use my drone to fix all damage now. I haven't actually got any damage, so there's nothing to really fix. Oh, that glide. Right, I'm going to have to... I just wait till she stopped talking before I went into my thing, but I'm gonna have to see if there's a setting to get rid of that glare because it's really irritating to be honest. So it doesn't seem like there was any settings change or anything that I could manipulate to be able to get rid of that glare, unfortunately, which is kind of annoying. We'll see if there's any side missions and stuff we can do on the way to this one again. Um That's the ship from earlier. There's also something over there that's kind of glaring at me. Let's go to this one first. Right towards the glare. Oh, it's you, Nora. Sorry, I'm looking for someone. Where the hell did they... Okay. Do this on the way, I guess. Oops. You're in. The mechanic, right? Chief of Enclave Engineering. Anyway, my boy... My boy! He loves to race, and went off without a single word. But after everything that's happened, it's not safe out there right now. Okay, I'll locate him. And his sister. 
She follows him everywhere. So she's lost too? I know. It's a... Damn. I'll find them. Just... Just let me know where they are. I marked one of their favorite spots for you. I'll keep searching in the other direction. Wasn't that the two kids that I raced? Um... I'm sure that's what it was. I thought it said he marked the map. Is it on missions? Can't track because I'm currently on a mission. Awesome. So I've got to do this story mission again. This is what I mean. They have these side missions here, but you can't actually do anything. Like, you're forced to do the missions in order, so it's not really a free roam thing. Forza. Forza. <laughs> the driving game. Okay, so we're going to go meet someone. A machine that made me unstoppable. Uh, a weapon then. I must be unstoppable again. Fight and kill again. You said that was our purpose. Maybe you still believe that. Or you will kill me on sight. Seems like a bit of a Maybe shitty so. gamble. But yeah, it seems I kind of have to do this mission again, which is really frustrating, like I said, because you've got all these side missions and you can't do them. And I can't boost my sublight drive again. Okay. This one, that's just one of them glowy points again, isn't it? Okay. I assume these things are going to kill me. Someone triggered the defense yeah. system. Plum lines. Another way in. The main entrance is still shut. Oh, maybe. Yeah, just blow them up. Like, why do I need to find another way in? Can I not just do this? I mean, problem solved, really. Go to this memory thing first. I know there's more miners next to me. I'm going to compare the difference with a Gatling gun. I mean, it seems these mines just aren't very strong in terms of taking direct damage, so it made no difference which weapon he used there. I was just curious if it made any difference in terms of actual straight-up right damage. That's the right way. Oh, really? I never know. things because there's a reason the red yeah now I can enter. Oh, okay I didn't realize I actually had to shoot them I just thought he kind of showed up and it was I teaching me something
In this tunnel, the audio for the ship's really loud as well if I slow down. Ooh. It's nice of them to show me a big red outline to show me I'm going to get blown up. If I'm just going at this speed, the ship sound is really, really loud. Boom. And another one. That was sneaky. Now, this is where I'd need a, like, yaw movement thing, because this is really annoying. Uh, can I not shoot this, really? So, like, that is directly at it. It's just... Uh, wait, how the hell... Have I been able to do this the entire time? Because normally it just spins. Is it because I'm going slow? That might be it. But that's much more helpful. There we go. Normally it just does that spin thing. Like when I do... When I go forward, it'll instead of just moving sideways, it'll boost sideways and spin around. Okay, so there was... Was that actually something I could press button on? Because again, it just flashed at me and I... There we go. It just randomly disappears, so sometimes you can, sometimes you can't. Hello darkness, my old friend. It's really nice of them to show me exactly where the mines are so I don't accidentally fly into them. As long as I take it slow, I'm pretty much fine. They're not a threat at all, to be honest. Uh, do I spot a secret? Wait, what the hell? We've got a big flash here. Okay. Again, nice of them to tell me before I crash into it, because that's what I was just about to do. Whatever drove them away, it was the circle. So there's a credit thing now on that side. I'll blow this up and then I'll go get the credit thing. But you see how I'm just kind of nudging from side to side? If I boost and then do the same thing, it just rotates like that. It's a lot harder to control. Ooh, the automation protocol level 2. Just take a quick look at that one. Reduces the repair drones downtime by 10%. Isn't that the exact same one as what the other one was? Fixer, yeah, fixer time minus 10%. I'm sure that's what it said on the other one. Might be just be the same one as what I saw in the store. What's the shiny shiny? I kind of want to know. Oh, it's one of these door things again. I'm assuming that's something I'm about to pick up in a minute. Couldn't actually even see where the mine was then. Ooh. Big boss time. I'm going on foot. That'd be a big change for this game.
Nasa, it's me. It's Nara. I came back for you. Yes. Seven years have elapsed. You set this unit on standby mode. You said... This will just be for a short while. I'll be back as soon as things calm down. I promise. I couldn't come back. I couldn't let people see a serpent. Negative. Do not lie. Mm. You never intended to return. Yes. Explain. I couldn't look at you, knowing what I'd done. I killed a planet. That's... I knew you wouldn't understand. You were in pain? Yes, I was. And now? Now... There's nowhere left to hide. And I need to do terrible things again. And there's no one else I can do them with. I know I let you down. I'm sorry. Welcome back, Nara. Ooh, new ship. He forgave her pretty quickly though, considering he left her alone. Uh, she left him alone, should I say. Ooh, much cooler looking. No big boss battle then. Will we finally hunt the circle? Yes, we will hunt them all, Forza. Just before I continue, it, um, what I was mentioning last time, by the way, when I said the voice for Sav sounded like the Colonel from Metal Gear Solid, um, I looked it up and it turns out it's not actually the same guy, it's somebody completely different. Um, I'm not 100% sure who because it doesn't say exactly who was who on the IMDb. Still feels responsive. The bond between our spirits regrew. What's with the yellow goldy line things now? Is that something new? I register all your intentions. So we can enter the drift trance. I'll drift. Whoa, what the hell? Ah! Oh, right, okay, okay, okay. Kind of think I kind of get this. Maybe. Ah! Got some need for speed style drifting going on now. Bet this is going to be really funky to do. Regrowth seals. Ah we shit, nice. I bet they're gonna try to make... Yeah, this is gonna be solid. Right, don't use my lasers for this. So where's the second one? It says at each side of the door. It says in there, looking at it. So I'm gonna have to... Drift across here and then shoot both of the things on the door so we'll go back. And give it a little bit of speed first. I'm not gonna boost it because I don't know if I actually need to do it. We hunt in the shadows. There we go. That's much better in terms of control. Still not perfect, but it's much better. Wow. Yes. That's what I was looking for. It felt like we were in harmony. No, despite our bond, I do not trust you. Yes, much better control. Retribution to hunt the circle. Ow, I didn't drift though, that was my fault. It is enough. This is gonna take some getting used to though, because the controls are a little bit fiddly now. Ah, uh, too fast. Slow down. I really like that drift control though.
Does your ship not hear that then? More regrowth seals, all lined up in a row. Okay. Drift and shoot. Uh. There we go. is free. I do like that drift control, but again, it is taking some getting used to. It's not proper yaw control, because obviously you still don't control your rotation correctly, but it helps. Just checking there's no credits knocking down one of them. There's something there. Memory. Yeah, exactly. She's only here and giving a shit about the ship because she actually needs him now. Like, if she didn't need the ship, she wouldn't have given a damn at all. She wouldn't have even cared he existed. Yes. Well, sir, we only have a chance against them when we work together. I am following you, am I not? That's much the better. Only way. Yes, since I have no choice. I am just no uh, machine. You mean so much more to me. Right. That is the point where I'm kind of getting confused, because if he means that much to you, why the hell did you lock him away and then leave him just sat in the middle of nowhere? I don't care if it causes you pain. If he means anything to you, you don't treat him like shit. That's just how it is. Like, I hate people that say stuff like that because if it's that painful for you, then surely you'd need a friend to get through it. Not just lock him away in some dungeon and say, there you go, fuck you, you remind me of what can cause my pain. And I'm more important than your life or your virtues or anything. You're not important, you know, you, but you're still important to me, don't worry about it, you know. Like, you're really, really important to me, but I'll lock you away in a dungeon until I actually need you for firepower. I don't blame the ship for being pissed, I'm completely on the ship's side. Which, I get it's an AI, but still. And then we hunt. I promise, Forza. Something else you left behind then. Kind of forgetting that I have the drift now because I've kind of gone so far without it. It kind of feels like a feature they should have maybe put in at the beginning. I understand it's like a big reveal type thing for the previous ship, but it just seems like a missing feature. A most peculiar uh, of regrowth boost drift. We must drift. No, this is gonna suck. All around us. I think I missed one anyway, so I can't do that because I saw one on this side. Yeah, I missed one there. I'm gonna try and do it without boosting because I've got a feeling that I might be lucky and get given enough time. Get rid of this. Might be a little more lenient because it's only a tutorial thing. Oh, yeah, I did it. I did crash, but I did it. <laughs> Figured because it were a tutorial, it'd be a bit more lenient. Oh, we've got ships to kill. Stand down and hand over our elder ship, nope. These guns are so much stronger. That literally is one shot in now. Mine vulture. So that's what's been dropping the mines off. I have to hit it in the ass. I see. Their stern is still Ooh. vulnerable. Then we can still hurt them. Yes, I'm. I understand. You want me to? Uh, get away from me.
Ah, get away! Oh. Oh no. I think I took that way too slow, that's why we're getting shot at and destroyed. Well, we got his first death. A circle vulture. Our prey now. Our prey now. I was waiting for a harder enemy, to be honest. Then we can still hurt them. Ow. I think we might want to shoot these as well. I was kind of hoping for a harder enemy there. Ah! Uh, mines. Oh, get off my screen. I understand what you're trying to do, boys. It's tedious. Ooh, that were close though, because I did but just fly into a bunch of mines. To cleanse the entire system. I will hunt beside you, but only if you let me visit a special place. What place? You will see later. Promise me. Of course, Forcer. I promise. I would like to visit a sex shop. Where am I going? Do I just fly out now or what? I didn't use the repair thingy either though. I could have probably got away with that. This way? Oh, it says leave site. I must get to the temple. Yes, of course. See, there you go. Now I've got to go to a I temple. something missing in you. Fractured. I am. I burned nearly all my rights out of me. Suppressed my gifts. Then you also abandoned part of yourself. Now, I need those rights back. Good. They made you a perfect warrior. Yes. I perfectly failed. I... I... When... If I fail again, Forza, you must stop me. Kill me. Please. Okay. Understood. Until then, we must fight. We will hunt them. Yes, we will. Okay then, so I don't know if we're actually locked in a mission again now or if we can do some of these side missions, but it seems kind of annoying that there's still stuff knocking around and I can't really do anything. Ooh, there's something I missed over here. I think they've just put that there because I would have seen that. It's right at... Oh no. Sorry, I thought it was at the entrance of where we came in last time, but it seems like it's more credit, so we'll get it now. Yeah, 312 credits. Now, the question is, do I keep my stuff from my old one? Uh, we've got a few upgrades on this, but just let's have a look at this first. Restore your ship's hull from pickups. I haven't even seen one. Of, oh, no, actually, I had one right in the tutorial. I haven't had one since. Damage received by mines is minus three, so just destroy mines. Enemies killed while drifting. Okay, I haven't actually killed anybody while drifting yet. Oh, good. We've kept his weapons on at least, so that's fine. I was just kind of hoping that it wasn't going to just suddenly give me a new ship and then get rid of everything that I've just paid for. To give me, like, a new weapon or something that's better. Wait. Oh, that sun thing. Oh, this is really irritating. I'll kill these the best that I can. I mean, it's got to be the, uh, intentional because when I'm behind the rocks now, it's fine. It's just really tedious. Like, certain things I really don't like with this game, but then the actual game itself is really fun to play. Dead pilot ahead. Yeah, you, again. That's two. Three. I love the fact that I can one-shot these now. Let's 
try drifting to kill them. Ooh, that is much better turning as well. They didn't hey. Stand a chance. Can't thank you enough. Here's some compensation. 375 credits. Okay, so I'm going to win this game here. And as always, people, thank you for watching.